Hi, Dirty Old Man here. I'm going to do another video today. And this time I'm going to talk about another YouTuber. But I'm not going to talk about a big time YouTuber like PewDiePie or Minnesota Burns. I'm going to talk about a YouTuber that has a moderate following. Uh, his name is Smokey Dog 7 Maybe a lot of you haven't heard about him. Maybe some of you have. Now, I'm not going to make the usual jokes people make about him that he, you know, or you got to call him bald. I know he shaves his head and people saying that, uh, oh, he's a virgin. I don't, I, don't, I don't, he's not a virgin. He, he has kids. I know that. But I will say he does look like he escaped from a crack rehab. He looks like an Ethiopian that got sandblasted. Anyway. I've been uh, subscribed to him for several years now, and I used to find him quite entertaining. He used to talk about different topics, and I remember I started, first subscribed to him when he's doing his Battlefield Call of Duty videos and stuff like that. It was entertaining. He was doing it. You could tell he was doing it for the fun of it, and it, it was fun to do. But now it's just like, now he's doing, now he just repeats himself all the time. He just hit like like a random topic, and then if if he sees that that random topic is getting a lot of hits, what he'll do is he'll do the same topic over and over and over again. You know whether it be about the zombies in Florida, and now his big thing is talking about oh the Xbox this Xbox that, which I know he doesn't hate the Xbox, and I know he's not a Sony fanboy, but he knows that Xbox videos irritate people. So he's going to keep doing them over and over and over. And it becomes irritating. I mean, okay, we got it. And I know you got it too. But the thing is, the same people respond. They click his videos. He gets paid. So that's what he's going to do. So it's like his channel used to morph from an, an entertaining channel where you talk about different topics to a channel where it's like, let me see what annoys people. And then I'm going to talk about that. It comes off as so phony. Anyway, it's apparent that he also sold, he sold his soul and his dignity to marry his fat fucking cow of a wife so that he won't have to work anymore. Nothing's free in this world. Everything has a price. And that's the price he's paying. I mean, here's a tip for all of you. If you have like a fat cow of a wife or a girlfriend or something like that, don't put her in a video if you're on YouTube or, or anywhere else on the internet because that will come back and bite you on the ass. So now he sits around all day in his house, in his pajamas, making YouTube videos, getting on Twitter, but usually only when his wife is not home. Because I don't think his wife likes it when he, when he does that, or it might bothers her, or whatever, or, or basically maybe he just, it's time for his ass to do the fucking dishes. So when she gets home, playtime's over. And make no mistake about it, you can take, you can say in his videos all he wants about his house. That's his wife's house, not his. I, you know, he didn't, uh, he didn't retire at an early age because he ran into some money. His wife got some money. Because you can tell, I mean, I doubt that this man's in love with this woman. I mean, this woman is huge. This guy looks like he weighs about 80 pounds. And I feel sorry for him because he made a video the other day where he talks about he only had one egg to eat in the house. So you know who's eating the food in the house. It's sure damn hell it isn't him. And I also remember he used to do these podcasts with a bunch of his friends. You know, he used to do them like a weekly basis, sometimes several times a week. Where he get on, talk about sports, talk about video games, and blah, 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 blah. And all that shit stopped to a halt. Let me backstab this a little bit to uh, to say that there was one time he was making a question and answer video where he's answering his subscribers' questions, and his wife he just says wife appeared downstairs, opening the door, so he bolted quick from the chat and turned it off. So either I think either his friends got annoyed with his fucking unemployed ass, or his wife just found him podcasting with his friends annoying, so she put an end to that shit quick. Now he does like Twitch videos at 4 o'clock in the morning and very quiet on my ads because that's like the only time that he won't be bothering nobody. Either when his wife's out of the house or late at night when everybody's sleeping. Ah, oh, Smokey, what happened to you? You used to be such a cool guy. Now, now you've degenerated into this milk sap of a fucking husband. Anyway, and now he's like bragging. Now he's bragging about that little bit of YouTube money he makes. 
three hundred dollars here, two hundred dollars there. Maybe a good month he make five hundred. That's probably the only money he gets to keep since he has no fucking. Maybe his wife gives him an allowance. I don't know. Maybe she does it. Maybe this is all this is the money he depends on. She probably takes a chunk of that money too. Anyway, she got to buy them groceries, leave them with that one fucking egg to eat in the morning. Yep. So pretty much, this dude is a prisoner in his own house. You don't see him ever go anywhere. He never goes on vacation. They don't do much of anything. Except he entertains his wife. He entertains his wife's fucking friends. And all this. In his wife's house. Smokey. What happened to you? You used to be so great. You used to be so entertaining. Now you've just devolved into this. Well, I'm going to say that I am unsubscribing today from his channel. And, uh, because, you know what, I, I just can't listen to phonies and fakers anymore. I know what you're doing. Just trying to, just trying to get, do controversial videos where you're just insulting people because it gets you views. And now you probably think I'm doing the same thing, but you know what? No. This comes from the heart, bro. I used to like you, but not anymore. Anyway, this is Dirty Old Man. And as always, go with God, but please do come back.